Well, a major concern this election is security, not only for your vote, but at polling places. And law enforcement locally at the state and federal level say they are ready. Barry Pintar joining us live out at a polling place in Ross Township this morning. Good morning to you, Barry. Yeah, good morning to you both at a very busy polling place at the uh, Ross Township Municipal Building. You can see the signs here. Let me swing around this way. Uh, this parking lot empty about an hour ago now filled with cars, mostly poll workers. I suspect that red car are folks getting ready to get in line to become part of the election process. Now, we're talking security. I want to say something right off the top because it's super important. As of right now, there are no election related threats that have reported been reported whatsoever. However, we can't deny the fact that 2024 has been a contentious election year. So it is of paramount importance that anyone get in line feel in safe. And to that end, let's use the example of the city of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, center stage for weeks and months on the all important swing state and Pittsburgh and the surrounding region being the center of that focus. Acting Police Chief Chris Raglan tell uh, well aware of that saying he's pulled all the stops when it comes to staffing and is ready to act if necessary. At this time we don't have any intelligence that we need to be in one area rather than another one. Um, we certainly have a plan in place that allows us to have flexibility and nimbleness to move in certain areas. Nationally, a similar story. The FBI is operating an election command post out of Washington, D.C. It's actually up and running all this week. Same situation there and that they're not only watching, but are on standby, ready to move into action in a moment's notice. This command post is an opportunity for us to bring people together. All the different subject matter experts here in the FBI at headquarters and in the field and we bring in our partners so that we can address information, intelligence, and threats. All right, so they're taking your safety, your security, extremely seriously. As I mentioned, mostly poll workers, I suspect this red car is someone just getting ready to go in line at any point. So let me leave you with this. When you go to your polling place, depending on where you are in the region, you may actually see armed police officers at your polling place. Again, they're not there to intimidate you. Don't feel bad about that. They're there to not only make sure you feel safe, but that the election process is completely safe mm -hmm. and secure. Reporting for you at Ross Township, Barry Pintar, KDK TV News. All right, thanks for the breakdown. Barry Pintar in Ross Township this morning.